We got App State headed to Troy. This is our Sun Belt special this week. Troy, a 10-point underdog, and this line moved a little bit. Uh, it opened up at App, I believe, at minus 8.5, if, cra- if I'm not crazy. Double-check that. Yeah, I think it was App, minus 8.5. So, uh, so Troy, of course, a 10-point underdog at home. They have looked good recently. Like they, They're playing better. Uh, I think everybody knows that I'm not a big fan of the coaching style of one Chip Lindsley. But uh, but instead, you know, Troy won five against the spread in their last five games as a home underdog of 10 points or less. This falls into that category. They just don't do well in these spots for whatever reason. They they beat teams that uh, that they are supposed to beat sometimes, and they always lose to teams that they are supposed to lose to. But ever since that Coastal Carolina game, like Troy has put up some fight, man. Like they they look all right right now. They got Gunnar Watson back at quarterback. Uh, the offense still isn't good, but but their defense has actually been okay. And against Chase Bryce in this App State offense, I think that he can slow them down enough and make App State uncomfortable to the point where, yeah, I think uh, I think Troy can actually hang within this ten points, especially at home on a Saturday or on a yeah on a Saturday. Yeah, I feel I feel good about this. I'm gonna take Troy plus the uh, plus the ten here. Okay, I kind of thought we were going to go the opposite way here because because I knew your feelings on, on Troy and, and the coaching staff. I like Troy, too. I think it's too many points. I think App State is getting a lot of uniform credit and name credit. App State's a really good football team. It's not a slight on them. I don't think they're a 10-point better than Troy on the road favorite, though. That's, That's it. Yeah. Uh, this is a math problem. That's all it is. Beating them by a touchdown still says you're a really good football team. But I think Troy's got some fight. I'm with you. I think Troy can win this game. I do if I too. think they can win the game, I got to take 10. I, I agree with you 100%. So, Troy plus 10 for both of us. And we are going to. I'll tell you this. This is, this is my logic for that. Okay. I'll be more surprised if App State wins by 20 than Troy winning the game outright. That's your 10 point difference in the spread. There you go. That's, that does make sense. I'm with you. Thanks for listening to the Winning Cures Everything podcast. The website is winningcureseverything.com, and if you want to connect with us, we're on Twitter, at GaryWCE, at ChrisBGiannini, at Winning Cures, or you can email us, Gary at winningcureseverything.com, or Chris at winningcureseverything.com. Subscribe everywhere you need to subscribe, and we'll see you soon.